We'll be having a motorcade starting from the Grand Bar Community Center, head down into Grenville, go right around the block in Grenville, right around Touria Street, come back um, Center Street, and come up to the Victoria Park. And the rally time is 12, and we go right up to 8, 8 p.m. That was Michael Batiste, first vice president of the Grenada Rastafari Cannabis Corporation. He emphasized the importance of this awareness campaign amid ongoing efforts by the government to decriminalize and ultimately legalize marijuana. This initiative is part of a broader effort to ensure that local farmers and other interested parties are well informed about the benefits and processes associated with cannabis cultivation and trade. To be in the cannabis industry is you have to be registered with a corporation, must be registered with an entity. And the Grenada Rastafari Cannabis Corporation is the vanguard over that issue. We've been clamoring over 20 years, 30 years for the legalization, you know, through the Church of the Nyabingi. But uh, with, the, with, the, with, with the realization in this time, we've been advised to have a, a specific corporation from the church to handle that business entity. Saturday's event marks the beginning of a series of sensitization and registration exercises organized by the Rastafarian community, which is receiving special consideration in this process due to their religious and sacramental use of the herb. It's a very sensitive um, time right now because the government is about to um, amend certain um, laws and, and get certain policies renew and um, we need the public, the strength of the public, the strength of the nation to get the corporation uh, running, get it on foot, you know, to harness whatever um, benefits would be there for us in that industry. So more or less is a, a day for registration in St. Andrews. We will be coming to other, the other parishes, don't worry, but we're starting off in the big parish. 29th, so we're calling all the people from Grenville and surrounding areas, the different villages, to come out on Saturday. The Rastafarian movement's proactive approach seeks to ensure that the community is prepared and well positioned to benefit from the upcoming changes in cannabis legislation. Reporting for GBN News, Amnesia Paul.